everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of It's Jenkins. This episode of It's Jenkins is brought to you by Quicksell's Probe King. Probe King, king of the probes. Okay, well the first thing you'll notice is we advanced the timeline quite a bit. I wanted to get Jenkins back. I mean, the show is really about him, so I don't want to substitute a pilot for him. So we waited the 18 days for him to be back. We're one day before the financial report. You'll also notice, too, that the uh, our C bills have disappeared, and that's because I put an engine and um, like a 240 core and a light engine in the Centurion just to start the repair work on it. So it'll be back just after the, the uh, financial report. So we do need to make some C bills today. So I, I've, the plan I've got for the Centurion is I want to move the weapons from the Clint into it and then add the Quicksell LRM-20 um, and then some ammo. And that should probably just fill it up perfectly. Uh, that's if we, when we put Pharaoh and Endo in. We should just have enough weight but what I really need today is a cockpit because I can't get the either cockpit or a fire control system like a ballistic or something. Maybe I pull the one off of the... Uh, I wonder if we should pull the ballistic one off of the Panther and put something else in there. But we need either a fire control system or a um, cockpit today to help out the Centurion with weight. So, with that being said, there's a, another one and a half skull mission we're going to take today. There wasn't a lot of good missions in the command center this month, unfortunately. But we've got this one. I don't really want to take it, but we're going to. There's um, pirate military engineers constructing fortified gun emplacements. So we've got to destroy the heavy gun emplacements, which will be four of them. And then there'll probably be a lance of mechs. So hopefully there's no artillery in the gun emplacements. It's just basically four turrets, right? So we're going to go ahead and do this one. I haven't done one of these in a while. Um, yeah, let's go full salvage because I've, I've got a feeling we're going to... This is pirates. We might find some half decent stuff. So we'll go that route. And we're going to bring Venom back in. We're going to pull Junker out for now. I'm going to move Mongoose down because he's only had four missions or three missions. Four missions in the Galleon. And Venom is back now. We've had five missions with her, so we'll put her in there. He can run the fire truck for now. And, uh, yeah, let's do this. Command interface okay, here we go. I need to get into a position where we can get our vehicles moving quickly. So we got to stay out of trees, or at least be right near trees if, we, if we're not in them. So this isn't bad because we got a bit of a road here. So that's... So the emplacements are over here somewhere. This will give them a direct line of sight on us, though. That's the problem. But we're on a road, which is nice. And they've got reinforcements back here, it looks like. Anywhere else I can go? It's going to make things faster for me? Not really. Uh, actually, this might not be too bad back here. So if we put the mechs up a little higher, then the vehicle's a little lower. We should kind of be behind this little crest here, I think. Interested to see, they may have actually two lances here. It's denying me a lot of terrain. Round two already. So there's a turret there. Shredder emplacement. Ballistic. Centurion A. Okay, so the ballistic turret What's up, boss? might be an AC-20 or it could be like an AC-10 or something crazy. That's just going to be the medium lasers, but we've got to stay in the trees until we find out what it is. Let's use the uh, height advantage here for a bit. We can see what we've got here. Standard two, two ER large lasers, not good things. AC-20, so it's out of range. Sniper turret, pair of AC-5s, that could be bad. Urban mech turret. Heavy PPC plus capacitor. Okay, that's a lot of armor. And dispensers, the only thing that can reach. This one. Might as well take a shot at it since we can, we can reach it. 
We'll save the mine dispenser until we know what uh, what lances we got here. So they've all got 240, right? 240. I think this one had 150. No, 240. Yeah. So not too bad. Standing by. Okay. Um. That's probably inside AC20 range there. That's not. It puts us in the open. That's a really good chance to hit, though. Let's take that. Going full throttle. We'll pull the ER larges down first, I think. We'll just go across the map. ER larges, AC20. I'm going to use this against this uh, turret. Yes, everything hit. Nice. Yes, Commander. Okay, JK. Uh, if I can hit you, that means you can hit me. So let's get down here. Oh, I think it's just the Rex laser that's in range here. Nope, combat shotgun as well. Nice. Rex missed, though. Commander. Uh, let's get to here. Got it. We'll sprint in next turn. They're still partially protected there. Waiting for orders. How far can you go? Can you get a shot at one but not the other? You can. Let's do that. Affirmative. Get some good chevrons. If we can pull this ER turret down, what do we also we got back there now? Hunchback 4H. Okay, not too bad. Fire an all weapon. Nice. Keep it up. We got one more. Commander. Ooh, why can't I? Because I can't see that guy. That's why. Lower profile, maybe? Plasma cannon and rockets. Let's get to here. Confirmed. Once we close, it'll be a little better, but until then... Oh, never mind. It's pretty good now. Um, what's 75 left? Let's go with the incendiaries. Let's go this route. Confirmed. Oh fuck, you missed with the big one. Uh, I should have left the uh, turret on. Or the uh, last... Uh, heavy damage. Damn it, I'm not enough though. Okay, AC5s. Comes the large lasers. Fuck. That damage is on you, kiddo. Barely hit, Commander. Oh, it is in range. I'm taking internal damage. That's my mistake. Cattlemaster. That looked like an ultra on that thing. Okay, let's get into here. Roger. Not exactly sure why this fire truck is so fast, but sure. Maybe because it's considered light or something? I don't know. Um, just go to 5. 27. Let's just try and finish this guy off. Locking in all weapon systems. There we go. One last turret. Alright. Waiting for orders. We know the deal now. Oof. They hit the... Really? Affirmative. <sighs> friggin' accurate, friggin' tar stupid turrets, damn it. Um, yeah, I'm still betting that's better for long range. 
All right, almost a little, they almost all hit, but I stripped most of its armor. I'm out of long range pistols. That's all right. You're out of this battle too, pretty much. Okay, somebody's got an AC AC5. There's an mobile enemy force, is there? Really? Couldn't tell. It's so hard to see when you're on the ground looking right at them. All right, hopefully we can shred this thing. Ah, maybe not. Roger that. Love that pulse laser or the uh, combat shotgun it explodes over here and ricochets down. Take that. Ready for orders. We gotta get the kill on this thing. Yeah, it's pretty good. Fire, Streaks hit, nice, nice, beautiful. Turret destroyed. Feeling pretty good. Receiving you. Temporarily, temporarily good. Not really in range of anything. Get into here though. Double time, let's go. We will attempt to uh, push that next turret. I think we gotta clear the last two turrets, I think, before we take on the mechs. It's probably a wise idea. Yes, Commander. Get right up there. Moving at full throttle. I don't know whether we're just out of range for that heavy PPC or what it is, but uh Nice. Hasn't fired yet. I'm sure it will this turn, though. Maybe it won't. Good to go. Um. Maybe it can't see us. Small favors. We don't seem to be able to have a line to it. It's probably just back behind that hill so that it can't see us. Which is fortunate for us. Ooh, yeah, man. Stripping armor. Camel Master. Camel Master X. Those people that don't like Irby's, I'm sure you equally hate the Cattle Master then. I mean, you can't like Irby's and or hate Irby's and like the Cattle Master. Big AC is coming in, but we're okay. I'm ready. We aight. Briefly, we aight. Let's move. All right, see if we can do this thing. Hopefully, we can pop this thing like a zit. Let's get them. All right, well, we got past the armor. Getting the crits, baby. I think things are going swimmingly. Don't waiting for orders. I do think they're going swimmingly. Double time, let's go. And you know why. Do not shoot the galleon. I copy. Nice. That turret is gone. It is. Waiting for orders. Don't want to just send the vehicles against the turret up there and just go mech to mech down on the ground. I mean we could. Roger that. No shooting, just running. Let's do that. We'll send the vehicles up. In theory, they're probably enough. I'm here. Get up here. I think the heavy PPC's got a minimum range, so if we deek in closer. May only have to worry about the medium chem laser. I don't know. We'll see here. Swordsman. Yes, Commander. Getting too many swordsmen. Plasma cannon. That's about it, eh? The tag. 
But that puts me in range of him to be able to shoot at me, so let's just get up over here. God, this thing looks so cool with that paint scheme. Okay. Orders. Uh, wait. Yeah, left side facing them, right? Wait, that's the right side. Darr. Am I doing this right? I think so. Like that. I'm That's right, right? Pretty sure it is. Let's just not get hit. How about that? Oh, nice. Get some retaliation fire in on him. Oh, he's going to drop his instability. Even better. And he turned his, his weapon side to us. Standing by. All right, you. Working on the turret. All weapons are good. Are you serious? I missed. 80... Are you actually fighting for us or against us? What the hell? 80 plus percent chance to hit and you didn't... Sure. Not even one of them, eh? That's what you got you, that's what you, got you killed in the last episode. Well, you weren't piloting it, so I can't really blame you. Rex hit, though. Orders. Can always rely on the quick sell stuff to hit. If you haven't noticed that by now, it's just pretty obvious, right? Affirmative. See, even she knows. Alright, we want to get rid of the senti, so... Or the hunchback, I mean. Let's go Inferno, though, because if we can get get some stuff off this guy... Let's go with rockets, too. We'll j try and jack his heat up early. Engaging target. Okay, not bad. Yes, Commander. We'll engage from back here. Try to spread out a little bit. I know I'm, I get clumped up all the time, but a lot of these maps, there really isn't much else, to, like places to go. So, ooh, yeah, drop that. Roger that. Okay, one laser hit, and the mines clustered fairly well. Not bad. I'm out of SRM. That's all right. Yeah, you hit, did you? I think that was a rocket pack. Or both of his rocket packs. Hopefully it was both. Yep, both. Let's do this. Alright, MG, get up here. Alright, next turn you can engage. It's not like it, the turret's taking any damage yet anyway, so... Don't feel like you're being left out. <laughs> surge light effect today. Eh? Turret's got a surge light. Oh, there's the swordsman. That's an interesting loadout. Ooh, he hit though. Armor breach, internal damage. Who's first? Enjoy those mines, baby. Someone's got a light rotary rifle. Barely hit, Commander. Standing by. Okay, it's got right up here. Just running. Not going in the trees because I want to uh, have a better chance to hit. This thing's got bad chances to hit, so if we can get a better one. Well, now that I say that. Excellent. Okay, good damage. Good damage. I wonder if it takes fire damage from sitting in fire. Damage is minor, Commander. Like if he doesn't move. Standing by. Does it take fire damage? Copy 
Copy that. All right, see if we can get the attention of some people here to share some armor. Focusing still on this guy, though. Got it. He's got an AC-10, so if we can pull that down, that'd be a uh, bonus for us. He's hitting some good shots, I'll give him that, that's for sure. Systems holding. Waiting for orders. Okay, On let's get to way. where the swordsman can't see me. Drop some instability. And we'll let this guy have it again. We're gonna be hot, but I'm okay with that. Uh, yeah, bolt-on rockets, everything. Aye, aye. Okay, nice. Got the tag on him. That shut him up, at least. Yes, Commander. Okay, you took the right side, so we want to put the left side towards... Wait, that's... like this. Not the best. Affirmative. Oh man, you can't keep missing like that. Ah, for fuck's sakes. Wait your command. We're in fire no matter what we are. We're standing in fire, so it's... It's only a matter where we go. Oh, that's a back strike on the, uh... I gotta take way. that. Double time. Let's see what we can do with that. Primitive. Okay, not bad. Getting the hits, baby. Okay, that opened the torso up. Standing by. Um. Let's see if we can pot shot the uh, 63. That's not bad. We'll take that chance. Shot. Nice. Excellent. Oh, he must have hit the front. Once more under the breach, dear friends. Oh, this guy's running. That guy's running. I think we gotta shut this swordsman up, though. Oof, nice shot, Senti. I'm under heavy fire. Yep. I'm your Didn't standing. move, though. Can I get behind that? Uh... I can't. What do I want to do here? Like if we push this swordsman hard... It's, we're, st we're still better off going against the... Uh, this guy. Let's walk it into here. I'm walking here. We can pull this guy down this turn. Welcome, my Alpha Strike. Yes. Good Alpha Strike, man. Quick sell for the good Alpha Strikes. This guy's taking the flames this turn, though. He's probably got a double heat sink kit, though. Good to go. Get good, let's get good tone lock on him, though. Get some good tone lock on him. Not that good. Uh, 
What is it with uh, 39 with Artemis, though? I'm going to have to switch back to that Hunchback next turn, but we can at least... Uh, I just got AMS, but didn't didn't stop very many of them. Ooh, head hit too. That's nice. Ooh, that's nice. Don't even move. Finish him up. Beautiful. Turret destroyed. Commander. Okay, let's move to there. Take a pot shot against the Crapple Master. Ultralight rotary. I copy. Negative damage. That's all right. Negative damage. Standing by. May need you down here. So let's get down here. Okay, not bad. Orders. Okay, get into here. Position confirmed. Hopefully gonna be sharing some of that armor soon enough. Yep, hammer this guy. Okay, a few good leg hits. Nice. Solid connection on that one. There's a possibility he could take his own leg here. Well, not really. Ready for orders. Put that centurion into range because he hasn't moved. Let's get an AC5 trade off on him here. Got it. That's a miss. It's alright, you're doing your best. Ready for orders. This guy's still baking though, eh? Okay, let's get into here. Target you. And let's bake this guy. Ooh, do we hit a head hit on him? Incapacitated. See ya. I'm receiving you. That was lucky. Okay, let's get down. Uh, yeah. All right, let's, move. let's engage. Keep the heat on. If we can hit a few times, we might get someone to bail out here. 16, 14. Let's just go after this guy. We got more shots, so. Fire and all weapons. Nothing. It's fine. Attack failed. That's all right. Thank goodness that was a miss. Yeah, without hunt, without double heat sinks, the hunchbacks with lots of lasers and like uh, big ACs is just heat so heat inefficient, you know. Commander. Can't get to his other side. Let's get over here. Double time. Let's go. We won't get a kill on this guy, but let's just scare the shit out of him if we can. Ooh, nice hits. Nice hits, baby. Okay, he's coming back through the mines. Well, there goes our right arm. Plasma cannon's gone. Weapon system down. Receiving you. Well, I gotta figure out something to replace that with. Can I not get a side strike on the? Uh, I can from here. Let's do it. On my way. On the hunchback here. While well, he's still tagged. 
It's this side I'm shooting though, but that's fine. Copy that. Ooh, nice leg hits. Scored critical. That's it for him. We should be able to pull that leg next turn. Yes, boss. Uh, can you get down? Yeah, you can. Just go this way. Just do it a little faster, because we're almost done here. I don't think that guy will be, uh, in combat. Wow, these guys got good initiative rolls. Ow. Losing lots of armor. I don't know how they got such good initiative rolls all of a sudden, but whatever. Maybe they use resolve. I wonder if that's a thing for them now. At least it was a leg hit. Light damage. Holding firm. Standing by. Okay, let's get into here. I am the wind. I think it's gonna be the cattle master, but we'll figure that out here in a second. Yeah, this guy's really a threat right now, so let's go after him. Firing all weapons. Ooh, baby. Everything hit. Gotta love it. Yes, Commander. All right. See if we can get the leg. Yes, baby. Hostile removed. Commander. That's really nice. Let's not go through the minefield, but we will go to there. And we'll let this guy have it. Target quiet. Bail out, no? Waiting for orders. Okay, let's get into there. Same thing, gonna go after the uh, cattle master. Ooh, yeah, nice. Reporting critical hit. Receiving you. Now you need to turn. Like that. Move order received. And, oh, we lost an SRM-6 too, eh? Well, we have to rethink the layout of this guy now. Roger that. Gotta rethink the loadout in this now. Inflicted some heavy damage. Yep, don't know what I'm gonna do. We'll see what, uh, what equipment shakes out of this place. I mean, we could just turn it into a laser boat too, right? Double heat sinks. I got tons of medium lasers. Damn. Well, they went after target of opportunity. Well, everything's in range, so let's use it. Aging target. Inflicted some. Ah, he bailed. Ah, uh, if Venom is dead, we're just gonna drive over that guy. Guy's been consistently hitting too. Centurion. How's it going? You might get into the battle. Damn close. Standing by. On my way. Everybody fights, nobody quits. Could try and overheat this guy, but we're just gonna confirmed. do as much damage as we can at this point. Oh, head hit, nice. Will be done. Don't 
that's better. We'll take that. Less of less uh, chevrons of evasion, but we drop our uh, instability. Don't have to worry about heat. Hit him, hit him hard. Hit him hard. Hit him hard. Not bad. Waiting for orders. Same thing for you, but we'll go into the trees here. Hammer him, baby. Oh, yeah. Nice. Think I hit something good. We'll reserve the Clint back past the other two. Oh, I don't think he'd be able to get a shot off anyway now. Good to go. Yeah, let's get into here. Roast them. Ooh, good damage. That hit something good. It did. Orders. What's the uh not bad? Engaging target. Put some more inferno on them. Keep them toasty. Standing by. Uh you're gonna reserve. Let these guys go and get out of your way. Full sprint, please. On the way. Double time. We'll heat up here a bit, but that's fine. Bon oh. Get the hits, get the crits, baby. Oh, I like that shot. All out of AC5 ammo. Man, this stealth gets away unscathed in a lot of matches. It's kind of shocking, but whatever. Taking the shot. Ooh, nice hits. Now we got you. Yes, Commander. Yeah, thanks for letting me know my walk distance there. I appreciate it. On it. Get in turn. Nice. Locked on. All right, some good hits. Not enough to knock him down, though. And he goes before us, because of course he does. Well, that's it for you. I'm here. It's me. Oops. Let's get into here. It's blocking my uh, Clint, I know that, but that's fine. Let's see if we can uh, get a headshot here. Locked on target. There you go. Head hit. Critical hit. Or was that a torso destruction? Waiting for orders. Still got lots of back armor, so uh, Roger that. I want this guy to bail. I want to max my salvage here. Most armor in the CT. Come on. Nope, not gonna bail, huh? Ready for orders. Location confirmed. Finally start moving back in. See if we can take his head clean off. Oh! <laughs> Did we get his head or was that uh I think that was the head. Mission successful. All right. Well, I gotta rethink the build now on the uh, Stormcrow. It's no longer gonna be an overheater. I don't know. I think it's tough to decide whether I'm enjoying the overheater or if I'm feeling like it's a uh, a uh, like it's a 55 tonner. I'm wondering if it should be outputting more damage than what it's doing. Like, this guy doesn't do too bad overheating stuff. It just takes too too long to get into battle. So I don't know. I don't know. i got to figure out what the loadout's going to be on that. So we got some Centurion parts. We don't have any Centurion parts. Hunchback parts. Swordsman 3. So this guy had what? This is the 3060 version. Heavy armor, firepower for the ton, seven and a half tons of armor, 
AC5, LRM5, SRM4, two medium lasers, and a small laser. Wait a minute, that can't be right, because what the hell? He was shooting me with, like, light PPCs or something. Wasn't he? I'm pretty sure he was shooting me with light PPCs. So that came from the turret. Ooh, that's kind of nice. Yeah, he was. He was using light PPCs. And a light AC-5, so maybe it's just a variant of the, uh, Swordsman. That's probably what it was. But the question is now, do I grab this and put it on the Stormcrow? Or do I grab the light, light AC-5 and the light PPCs and use that in the Stormcrow? Because we don't have a lot of, um... We don't have a lot of weight available to us. Thunderbolt 2 pack. Endo steel. Light engine. We got four double heat sinks. We got double heat sinks. We're okay there. Prototype double heat sinks. Standard engine. Stealth X. Precision AC5 ammo too. Ooh, like if we grab this. I need a cockpit or something too, but I'm not going to grab that. If I want the light AC5, it's 5 tons for 35 damage as opposed to 45 damage for 8 tons. 10% jam chance though. Mitigated by gunnery, so it's not too bad. But these things are 3 tons each. Grab two of those. This is a pirate version. 20% chance to misfire when firing in FC or scatter mode. Hmm. 50 heat though. I don't think I can sink that. Unless that's my prime. Like, like that's my only weapon. I could go with the Thunderbolt 2 pack as well though. MML5. We've already got one of these. I mean we could run with light PPCs, MML5s, and go with LRM and SRM ammo. That's 3, 6, 9, 12, plus 2 tons of ammo. 14. Then round it out with some medium lasers or something. I can't take the basic cockpit. I just... I should take the light engine though. I should grab the light engine. Or we could go for some C bills because we're going to need money to repair stuff too, right? Like I could grab this and sell it. It's not going to give me much though. 200 and something thousand, 300,000, somewhere around there. Stealth X. SRM LK ammo as well. Hmm. Like I could go light PPCs, two SRM 4s. Or we could just go all long range stuff. Like maybe I put the four quick cell LRM 5s on there too. Ooh, then we, would, we could put the Thunderbolt 2 pack on there. And have another Clint Buster. But then if we're going to go long range, then wouldn't it be better to grab this? 700 meters though, so what are these, 720? 7 something? 720. It's pretty close to the same distance. Actually, how many swordsman parts do we have? We got one. I mean, we could grab... Uh, if we grab two parts... We don't really have the ability to do that, though. Got lots of hunchback parts. Ooh, I don't want to gamble. Like, we could try and grab the swordsman. 
and gamble that we get another swordsman part, but I'd rather not do that. I'm going to grab this, I think. The problem is, is we don't have a lot of gear. That light engine's nice, but I think... I could have got one already still, right? I got one left over. I put one in the Centurion. We got one left over. So let's just grab these. We did, oh, we did get a swordsman part. Two cattle master parts. AC5. Heavy rifle can just go. Mining drill. Uh, we might use it. I'll hold on to it. I doubt it. But Oh, we got the MML5. Nice. Armor can go. We got a basic cockpit too, which is nice. Double heatsink. Prototype double heatsink. Fusion core, which can just go. That's 100 grand right there. AP, AC20 ammo. AC10 ammo we don't have any of, so we'll keep both of those. Two evasion pips ignored for precision, eh? That's pretty nice. Yeah, 187,000. Well, I knew that. 16 days, though. That's going to be a little bit more than I thought. What do we got here? 12 days for the Storm Crow. Definitely want that up. The Clint. Let's get the Clint. Hmm. I think we do the Centurion first. Actually, let's get the, the Panther done first. Yeah, we'll go this route. It's We're going to be into the middle of next month before we... <laughs> oh, man. If uh, Quicksell doesn't give us a sponsorship soon, we're going to run out of money. Um, <laughs> maybe we jump to another... Pl I don't think we're close enough. I think we jump to another planet that's got better... Ah, uh, you know what? We'll stay here. We may have to take a few milk runs, but that's fine. I was hoping that these last two missions would be more more or less milk runs, but didn't work out that way. Yeah. All right, let me get these mechs repaired and replaced. I think I'm going to pull the Clint out of service and get the Centurion up and running. With the precision ammo and the, the uh, accuracy bonus and stuff, Stormcrow will switch to the light PPC build, go with more range stuff. So it doesn't have to close as much. We'll stick with the Panther and the uh, the Stealth closing, and keep the Clint and the Cent or Clint and the Centurion or sorry the uh, Stormcrow and the Centurion back a bit to hammer from range probably. Well, I'm gonna end the episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to, feel free to subscribe. Go to the Quick Sell website and tell them to sponsor Jenkins. Until next time, I'll see you later.